The chairman of the National Drug Law Enforcement Agency, NDLEA, Brigadier General Mohamed Marwa, retired, has confirmed the arrest of 50,901 drug offenders, including 46 barons, and the conviction of 9,034. Marwa also said the seizure of over 7,561 tons of illicit substances in the past 38 months has sent the right message to drug cartels and their kingpins that Nigeria would not tolerate their criminal activities. He said that this in Lagos while delivering his remarks at the commissioning and handing over ceremony of an operational facility built and donated to NDLEA by the British government. According to him, the British government had been of immense support to Nigeria in its fight against the use of illicit drugs. I must begin by expressing our deepest gratitude to the British government for their unwavering commitment and invaluable contributions uh, course. From the onset of our collaboration, the UK has been a steadfast ally in our relentless pursuit to neutralize transnational organized criminal activities, particularly in the realm of illicit drug production and trafficking. The significance of this project cannot be overstated. It will serve as a vital hub for data analysis and strategic planning in our efforts to disrupt drug trafficking networks and apprehend those responsible. Speaking at the ceremony, British Deputy High Commissioner to Nigeria, Johnny Baxter, assured of continued support to NDLEA and Nigeria. We are absolutely delighted to be supporting this office, but we're absolutely delighted to be continuing our support to the NDLA and to the Nigerian government to tackle what is sadly a global industry. And a global industry needs a global response and needs governments and partners to work together. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.